Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to reverse a string of text. So, for example, we have these two sentences, and here's the reverse of them. Now, why would you want to do this? Well, in software development, it seems to be something that is done actually quite often, or maybe you would get an interview test, and you would have to develop some code to reverse your string of text. Now, we can just use Excel to create that reverse string of text so we can validate it um, after the code has been written. So, in this example, let's say that I would say the weather is nice today and I can just click this right click refresh and it's going to reverse that text for me and before Power Query you might have to write a combination of functions using the right mid or transpose or even write some VBA but in Power Query you can just do it with a couple lines and that's it so let's see how it's done let's put this into a table control T to put in a table my table does have headers click OK go to data and then from table and range we're going to get and transform that data then we're going to have this as text click on that go to text it's going to create the transformation of text and what I need to do is go to add column add a custom column I'll just give this custom column the name reverse and then type in text dot reverse open parentheses Double click that input string, close parentheses, there are no syntax errors, click OK, and now we have the reverse of that text string. Now we can right click, remove, go to home, let's close and load, close and load to, and let's put it on the same sheet here, put it as a table, existing worksheet, let's put it here in column C, put, put it in cell C1, press enter, click OK, and now it's going to show up here in C1. I'll enter in another string of text. I'd love some sugar with, with that. Press enter, right click, refresh, and now we would have the reverse text there. So that's how you can reverse text string Excel. Not that many uses, but for software developers, if you want to validate it and make it easy to create a whole list of sentences to validate and look at your code, this might be an option for you. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.